obviously a massive game, uh, grand final. These are sort of the moments that you live for in your career. Yeah, of course. Uh, we take every game as if it's a final. So yeah, going, going into the game with the same momentum, same game plans, and yeah, just looking forward to a good game. Uh, Comets have obviously had an incredible season. Uh, I think, what is it, only two losses, uh, one draw. Uh, so credit to them for the season. They've got quality all over the park, so they don't really have any weaknesses. Their midfield with the Sasaki sisters, they've got prolific goal scorers all over the park. You know, four or five players that can easily score goals, win them games. Uh, and so that is obviously a worry as a defender. You don't just have to worry about one player, you have to worry about four or five. Yeah, um, we all know what Salisbury Inter are capable of, um, but we just got to follow our game plan and yeah, I think it'll be a good game. Uh, we have such an amazing group of girls, we all get along so well. Um, yeah, we love each other, so I think yeah, having such a close group of girls is exactly why we've been so successful this year. We have a bit of experience in the team. Uh, we were in uh, cup finals two years ago, so hopefully that experience gets us over the line on Friday night. I think just being clinical in front of goals. Comets are a team that they haven't conceded too many goals this year and so I think any opportunity that we have we just have to be really clinical in front of goals. Yeah, like I said, just continuing to um, work hard like we have the whole season and um, following our game plan and yeah, just putting on a good show for everyone. Sills Greens is amazing. Uh, I think we're, no, we're probably the underdogs going into Friday night. And I think Australia loves a good underdog, so let's go for Inter. Hopefully we see everyone out um, supporting our Comets women's team. Um, yeah, we're going to need you to help cheer us on.